So we have a special news item today, which uh, kind of surprised everyone when it was announced. Hey, I know that show. You recognize that show? That looks familiar. It looks familiar. It's, it's kind of an older show. Um, a lot of folks around probably have heard of it. That Rickenbacker guitar, yeah. that bass guitar looks very mm -hmm. familiar. Yeah, what is that from? Do you recognize it at all? Do you know what that's from? Is that Lord Canto there or behind? That is Furry Curry. Um, so what's happened is Furry that uh, Production IG, the anime studio, um, has acquired the rights to Furry Curry. Whoa. Um, it would, now, granted, they co-produced Furry Curry. Uh, the, the important thing here is that uh, they plan to do a new anime remake of Furry Curry. Hmm. Now, folks may, may wonder, you know, they're saying Furry Curry, but there's FLCL on the screen. That is actually, Curry. yes, that, that, that is a pronunciation. That, that is part of the, the, the name, <laughs> Furry Curry. <laughs> so, yeah, they, they are apparently planning to do a, a, a new remake. Now, Furry Curry is an OVA from uh, the year 2000 oh. uh, to 2001. Uh, produced by Gainax, or made by, made by Gainax, with, again, IG kind of co-producing it, so they helped a lot with the animation and such. Um, I'm not even going to try to describe the plot. <laughs> yeah, it, it's one of those sorts of things, very postmodern, uh, or rather postmodern, I should say, and just very strange. Um, very strange. Very, very strange OVA, and apparently it's sold quite well. Yeah. Uh, ever since it came out. Certainly since it's sold well over here in America. Um, and so the question is, what do they mean by a new anime remake? Remake? I mean, there were six episodes, mm -hmm. and uh, when I first saw this, I was dying to find out more, and it was mm. their website was all in Japanese, and they weren't going to do any more of these, even despite all the fans saying, "Hey, we want it, we want it," mm. and and so I was. I was kind of left at the last episode going, I want more, I want more. Mm. This is, this is, this, I want more closure. Yeah. <laughs> this is just too bizarre and abstract to leave off here. I want more. Mm -hmm. uh, but for years we got nothing. And so finally they got some releases uh, here in the U S besides yeah. uh, uh, just the, what we saw on, I think adult swim had it for a little mm -hmm. while. And, yeah. and uh, but I hadn't heard any news until, well, and here's the interesting thing. It's not a sequel. It's not a sequel. It's a remake. It's now, a remake. granted, it, what, what, what's possible, and some folks have suggested, is that instead of actually doing like a plot remake, they're going to go back and basically remaster it for, for high def. Hmm. Um, so that might mean reanimating sequences. It might mean just kind of reproducing them, reassembling them from the original materials. Now, this was, this was around what year? 2000? 2000. So are, is there a possibility there might be cells? Possible. I have no <gasps> idea. Um, oh, to get a cell from that. <laughs> um, but, but they're going to remaster it. And now, didn't they have a Blu-ray release? Yes, yeah, they did. But this will be remastered? Yes. Potentially. 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 Mm -hmm. um, this is the thing. And so um, a little while back, there was the Gundam Seed Destiny um, HD remaster set version where they went, went back to Gundam Seed Destiny, which was made digitally. Um, but they went back and sort of recomposited it and kind of rebuilt it for HD. Hmm. Um, just, you know, again, kind of reworking the, the material to make it look better in HD. Again, I don't know if that's what they're going to do with, FL, with Furry Curry, but that would seem to be the more sensible thing rather than just trying to redo the story from, with new animation from scratch. New, new animation. I, I can't imagine. It's so iconic already. Yeah. But then again... Full Metal Alchemist mm. was redone, but Full Metal Alchemist was based on a manga. This wasn't. Mm. You know, this is an original story. So you know, the uh, Brotherhood was was partly to go back and and make something more faithful to the manga. There's nothing to be more faithful to this. You know, that was the original yeah. creation. How did they come to this conclusion that it was worth? That's the this? question. I mean, certainly, you know, like we said, it, it, um, sales have been solid. So, you know, it, it would make sense to go back and at least do something along those lines. Now, of course, the other thing is, what is, you know, is new anime remake literally an accurate translation of the words? You know, there, there's, it still remains to be seen. That could be a mistranslation. It could be, you know, an accurate translation as far as we know, but they meant something different. Who knows? Um, but it, it, is, it is strange that they would try to do that. Um, yeah. Ultimate Furikuri Kai Crystal Brotherhood. 
Um, <laughs> that'll be a, the new version. <laughs> so yeah, it's 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 strange. Um, now, production IG did note that the dub versions have been popular overseas, uh, particularly in North America on on Adult Swim, um, and there have been a novelization of the story. Which you know, imagine that. There, 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 no, there it is, right there. Uh, the first volume, at least. And uh, yeah, I got a, a great little uh, art piece of Furry Curry there. Yeah. So I think yeah, a postcard I got somewhere. Yeah, <laughs> nice. Thank you, promotional. <laughs> <laughs> so it's it's hard. To, oops. So it, it's hard to tell what's going on there. Um, and of course, a uh, manga adaptation as as well. I wonder if the pillows are still going to do the ending sequence. Yeah, ride on know. shooting star. Yeah, it's 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 hard to say. Um, again, it might, might just be an animation um, retooling. Hmm. Um, uh, are, are, who knows? They they had this uh, uh, stop motion uh, right. video yeah. of of the scooter mm -hmm. going all over the place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was a riot. I'm like, what are they going to do? Make it more smooth? You know, I don't more know. frames. I can't yeah. imagine. Yeah. Um, who knows? Um, it, may, it might be new material. It might be omake. It might be special animation omake. You know, in addition. Omake. Uh, special features, basically. Oh. Um, special animation. New, I was new getting new hungry thinking that. Uh, uh, omake. Mm, tasty. Wait. Uh, yeah. Even so, special features would be good. It would. Who knows? So that is the strange news, uh, or the, the, that is the, uh, the major news. Um, one other thing, actually, we wanted to mention that I haven't mentioned. Uh, here actually this is a surprise for Evan um, mm. the Love Live film uh, Love Live being a recent pop idol anime series uh, is going to come out uh, on Japanese Blu-ray with English subtitles on the Japanese version Whoa! now we're both surprised because you know we both know that it's very rare for anime in Japan to have English subtitles um, I think only well, I know Studio Ghibli titles uh, so Miyazaki's movies they all have English subtitles uh, partly because they, you know, um, they're so well known internationally, and then there was something else that got English subtitles. I can't remember what it is, but yeah, yeah other than that, it just that doesn't rare occasion. Yeah. yeah, it just it just does not happen. Um, so that's an interesting thing. I don't know if that's a trend, but it's certainly good to see. I like that. Yeah. Now, yeah. of course, um, if you're getting the the limited edition, that'll cost you eighty one dollars for that uh, Blu-ray, and the regular edition will cost fifty six. Hmm. So it's not going to be cheap. No, um, but at least it's potential. Um, this is a, a Bandai visual release, so the question is whether this is essentially trying to do what they did for Gundam Unicorn. This is going to be kind of an international release. Mm. The idea being that you know, if you live in America and if you want to copy this right now, you can buy it for fifty-six bucks and get you know mm. get a version you can actually watch. It would be nice to see this uh, have some success. Yeah, totally. So if you like Love Live and you you want to see more success, that'd be a good thing to support. Uh, head on over to CD Japan uh, or other sites like that that will actually ship you stuff from Japan. Um, and we'll see where this goes. Yeah. Now, part of the reason I, I mentioned this is because uh, Black, Rock, Black Rock Shooter, thank you. That's the other one I was thinking of. Um, I think there was, there was, but I think there was Seven one other two. languages. That's great. Yeah, that's really it's nice. It's like the Rosetta Stone. Yeah. <laughs> like, I can learn all sorts of stuff. Um, now, of course, um, and this is a, another uh, interesting point is that the film will also be released in the United States. So there's going to mm. be a, a U.S. release of this film. I suspect that they got it subtitled early because they knew it would it would be um, aired or they, it would be screened in America. So it could be that they were like, "We're going to have the subtitles. Let's put them on the release." And so we have an extra thing for the deep, for the Blu-ray. Who knows? But or, so I I, I got to admit that's good production. There, <laughs> it's a good idea. Um. I do have kind of a uh, an ulterior motive for running this story, um, and that is that um, I still run into a lot of anime fans who think that just because it has English subtitles, um, um, that well, back that up. A lot of fans who buy anime from various sources and they see the English subtitles and think it must be an official release. Oh. Um, and they, you know, I've, I've come across folks who are like, I bought the original Japanese version, which has English subtitles oh, for you know, $15 online. They don't do that. They don't do that. So, <laughs> well, yeah. If, if, fan sub being sold as the legit, but it 
does not sound no. like it's legit. No. So if if you do see a, a Blu-ray or a DVD online um, and it has English subtitles and they claim it's the Japanese version, unless it's Studio Ghibli or the Love Live film, uh, I would be highly suspicious. Mm, so many scammers out there. It's it's sad. It's very sad. But yes, this is legit. Mm -hmm. Good. It's a good yeah. thing. So that's the news for now. Thank you all for watching. Thanks for watching.